Hi, it can be challenging to find a sunscreen for oily skin type. You want the sun protection, but you don't want the stickiness and the oiliness. So I have some recommendations for you. I have recommendations for oily skin, for acne prone skin, for oily sensitive skin, and also some high end luxury sunscreens, which you might find interesting. So let's get started. So few things to remember whenever you search for a sunscreen for oily skin always go for a gel based sunscreen a gel based sunscreen is lightweight it'll always feel less sticky and less oily on the face so that is one thing you can look for also you have to make sure that the sunscreen fits your budget sunscreen is not a one time purchase so in this video i have recommendations with all budgets in mind okay so choose the one that suits you that you can stick to for a longer period of time that is very important if you get very oily in the morning then you may want to use a serum and then go on directly with a sunscreen you may want to skip the moisturizer if you have very oily skin at night remember to never skip the moisturizer over the serums you are going to apply a thin gel based moisturizer in order to keep your skin from getting dry overnight if your skin gets too oily when you get up in the morning then using an adapalene or retinol at night before you sleep can really help in oil control so what are a few things that you need to look for in a sunscreen first the spf has to be at least 30 if you're going to be working indoors in a closed space not too much of sun exposure then spf 30 is enough if you have a lot of sun exposure you're going to be outdoors sun exposure for more than 20 to 30 minutes in a day then go for spf 50 okay if you're going to be sweating and outdoors then you want to go for a water resistant sunscreen make sure that the sunscreen also has pa3 plus at least to give you uva protection remember that reapplication of sunscreen is very very important you have to reapply sunscreen every two hours for it to be effective especially if you're out or you're sweating or you know you're toweling yourself or you're wiping your face then every two hour application is very important if you are indoors in a closed space or if you're at home and don't have too much of sun exposure then applying the sunscreen once or twice in a day is enough so now let's dive in right to the recommendations so my recommendations for oily skin are dr shade's haldi hyaluronic acid sunscreen the Dermaco Hyaluronic Gel Sunscreen, Pond's Non-Oily Sunscreen, this is one of the most affordable brands, VLCC SPF 50 Sunscreen, Dot & Key Vitamin C Sunscreen, and Minimalist SPF 50 Sunscreen. All these feel very lightweight on the skin, they blend seamlessly, they will not feel sticky or heavy on the face, and I'm sure you'll love these sunscreens. Now, if you have active acne or acne prone skin, what sunscreen should you use? My recommendations are Fix Derma Shadow Sunscreen, Acne UV Gel Sunscreen, Sunstop Silk Sunscreen, Photostable Sunscreen, Sun Coat Gel Sunscreen. Sunscreens meant for oily skin can also be used for acne prone skin as well, but I prefer these ones because you want to make sure that it does not have any uh, ingredient that can irritate your skin or make your skin, you know, further break out into acne. So these are the ones I prefer for acne prone skin. So now let's move on to the recommendations for oily sensitive skin. This recommendation is for people with very sensitive skin who are not able to tolerate any sunscreen. They feel that whenever they apply a sunscreen, their skin feels either itchy, red, irritated. So for them, these will work. I have a detailed video on sensitive skin. Please do check it out. You will find it very, very helpful and really help in managing your sensitive skin. So my recommendations are Lashil Physico Sunscreen and Bio UV SPF 32 Sunscreen. Sunscreen for sensitive skin type has to be a plain zinc oxide sunscreen. So the Lashil Physico is a plain zinc oxide sunscreen and the Bio UV has a tint. It has a really nice matte finished feel to it. It feels very mousse like a foundation. So if you are somebody who is looking for a tinted sunscreen, then this is a very good choice. Now a few high end brands. These are pharmaceutical brands itself, but they, you know, I put them in a luxury category because they are a little expensive and you need to use sunscreen on a regular basis, at least three times in a day. So make sure that you purchase these only when you feel that you can use it in the long run as well. So a few of my recommendations are Helio Care sunscreen. This is one of my favorite. It has slight tint, Isrin Photo Protector and Avene Dry Touch. Helio Care sunscreen works really well if you are looking for a very light gel based sunscreen which also gives you a little bit of a foundation finish this works wonderfully and the Isden photo protector fusion water sunscreen this will also work very very well if you are somebody who doesn't like any sunscreen if you find everything very oily sticky you will love this formulation Avin dry touch is also one of my favorites for people who have oily skin type it completely gives a matte finish does not feel oily at all but also does not feel very silicone -y. it has a really nice finish to the skin so this is something that you can try out 
I hope you found this video useful. It is a very short video discussing sunscreens. We know how important sunscreens are. Make sure that you use the sunscreen that is right for your skin type. And sunscreen is very, very important. Now there are multiple sunscreens available in the market. If there's something that already suits you, you can stick to it. This was just a general guide. If you already have something that you like, you don't need to switch it. But this is just a general guide for somebody who is looking to for a sunscreen for oily skin type. It might take some hits and misses for you to find the one that suits you perfectly, but it will be worth the effort. I hope you found this video useful. If you like such skin and hair related content, you can follow me on my Instagram handle, Dr. Anchil MD. I post such skin and hair related content daily. Thank you for watching.